Music and Arts Festival, formerly known as the Folk Festival, is a changing space and place that exists in our minds, our hearts, and the heartland of our beautiful city, Victoria Park in London, Ontario. Over the course of 44 years, these changes occur and make the festival broader, more inviting, and pertinent to the well-being of our city. Starting in 1973 as a small town gathering for artists to come and enjoy folk music, it is now a festival encouraging craftspersons, artisans, musicians of all kinds, as well as cuisinary culture and even a community open stage for everybody to sign up and perform apart from the headliners on the main stage. Not an artist yourself? That's okay. Home County has a way of inspiring people with its natural objects for sale, like handmade beaded and braided bracelets and pottery. This summer, our creative team took interviews, letters, memorabilia, and footage of performers, festival goers, and vendors to celebrate 50 years of history in London, Ontario. We heard from you, your unique perspectives, experiences, and opinions, and hope to hear more in order to give back themes of value over the next six years. We have been working on this project for a few years, starting in the library archives in the Home County Council at Grosvenor Lodge, moving out into the public as we gain a stronghold of information. In 2023, Home County will turn 50 years old and crazy, beautiful people will be releasing both a book and documentary, each compiling 50 years of history to celebrate the importance of this festival in our city, London, Ontario, Canada. As the longest standing summer festival of its kind, Home County is significant to all of us for different reasons, but ultimately, like other festivals, it brings people together. We each come out to a social site in hopes of discovering something positive about ourselves and the world. But what was it that brought you here instead of another place? Home County draws in members of the community because of its accepting appeal. You know you'll find a place to fit in with that many artists. So what makes you different? How are you a crazy yet beautiful person? Situated in the downtown core, Victoria Park is accessible to all, including dogs. Some of the most repetitive things that I heard from people were that they were just looking for a place to take their dog out to socialize with other dogs, or a place to socialize themselves. Home County was often the first event newcomers to London, Ontario came to. Why? Home County is often referred to as a place where people can enjoy good food, better music, and the best people. What is it about this festival that's different from other festivals? There is a modest hometown alternative vibe Home County carries with it, which you can see from looking at the pictures before you, each taken from this July 2017 festival. If you, or someone you know, is willing to share their home county memories or memorabilia, please contact us online at facebook.com slash cbpeople. We want our project to reflect the pride of home county festival from each and every single person that it has changed. CB. It wouldn't be home county if it didn't rain and that's why we are called crazy beautiful people because in the 1970s when uh, home county first started Valdi came out on stage and said to 6,000 wet fans you crazy beautiful people and everybody has now abandoned the community open stage behind us so nobody is crazy or beautiful today. <laughs> 